The next step in this process is to create the sheet set file. The sheet set file is used in the plan production functions. The reason we create the sheet set file after the template file is because the template file will be referenced in the sheet set file. The template and sheet set files are linked and having both of them set up properly will increase your efficiency. Similarly, to when we created a template file, we are going to use an existing sheet set file to create our own sheet set. We will then edit the sheet set to include the information that we need for our specific project. So to start creating the sheet set file, come up to Application Menu, New, Sheet Set. On the first tab, the Begin tab, we're going to use an example sheet set. Next. Now we need to choose the example sheet set. You may or may not have example sheet sets here. We don't. What we are gonna do is we're going to use the sheet set file that is in our exercise folder. So I'm gonna to navigate to my exercise files and find my civil imperial sheet set file. I'm gonna go open. Now I go to next, and we are going to give our sheet set file a name. I'm going to call this Dorland Avenue Project. And I can give it a description. Now, where am I going to store my sheet set file? I'm going to put it in my exercise files. So I'm going to navigate to my exercise files. I'm gonna save it in chapter one. I'm going to leave the create a folder hierarchy based on subsets unchecked. In the next video, we will look into sheet set properties. But for now, I'm going to confirm. This is the sheet set that we're going to create. Dorland Avenue project and it has these sheet subsets. We're going to delete them. And we are going to edit this information down here. How the new sheet sets are going to be named, model views, and new subsets. We're going to leave this all as default and edit most of it as we go. I'm going to hit finish and it opens our new sheet set. And I'm going to go ahead and delete all of these sheet subsets. These are all sheet subsets. I'm going to delete them because we are going to be creating our own. I'm gonna right click to remove subset, right click, remove subset, and you can keep right clicking and removing them until there are no longer any subsets. When we create our plan and profile and our section sheets, that's when subsets will be created. But for now, we're just leaving it as the Dorland Avenue project with no subsets. The next thing we need to do is edit it to include our template file and specific project information. 